this is an Android phone, yeah. the home screen. And uh, so these are all actually HTML5 based web apps. So they look just like a native app to a consumer. Um, and when I open it, it looks and feels just like a native app would. But it's actually just uh, a web app. So, you know, I can open several of these other apps as well. Uh, and of course, using HTML5 technologies like offline storage and cache, uh, you can actually have these available offline as well. So you don't have to be online uh, just because they're, they're HTML5-based web apps. So, uh, but because they are web apps, you only have to develop once, and they work across all of these devices. So uh, tablets, phones, this is a, a, a Mac that has uh, several web apps. So you can see Basecamp actually has its own uh, dock icon, just like a native app would. It has its own you know, menus, it has its own window that says Basecamp. So we really want these to feel just like a native app would, um, even though they're, they're actually web apps. The user doesn't need to know that they're web apps. Um, okay. So this is Firefox for mobile. This is Firefox for mobile on Android, yeah. uh, and this is just a website. But you can see that it can get the battery status. Uh, it can get geolocation. So this is all the API, APIs you can access yeah. from yeah. web apps. Okay. Uh, but the, to access uh, these APIs, you need do you need. Um, Firefox Mobile, or it works on standard browser? So this works on Firefox for Mobile. We've submitted them for standardization to the V3C. Um, I think some of these work on other browsers, not all of them yet. Uh, okay. uh, but we're, you know, we're definitely pushing for it to get there. Um, so this is the accelerometer, so for games and that sort of thing. Um, we can actually do notifications as well. So uh, when this when this gets to there, it'll do a system notification. Okay, great. Um, it can make the, the phone vibrate. It can even uh, take a picture. So I'll take a picture, and then it will take that picture and apply a filter to it like Instagram would. Uh, so this is all just things that HTML5 can do in a website today that apps, will, that apps can do. Um, 